will get the vaccine or get laid off. It's now the reality for one of Wisconsin's largest employers. Adam Duxer spoke with the decision makers at Epic and explains why this is happening right now. Well, it's a decision that other major companies throughout the country are already making. And as the Delta variant of the coronavirus continues to spread, Epic System says they had no other choice. It's news that carries big implications for America's largest handler of medical records. As of October 1st, we are asking that all of our staff be vaccinated. All 11,000 of Epic System staff will be required to get the shot. 97% already have, leaving just about 350 unvaccinated. Those in charge say they can't take chances. Each one of those people may be interacting with a doctor or a patient or somebody who does interact with a doctor and patient. So we take it very seriously to keep everybody safe. Epic joins other major tech companies, including Facebook and Netflix, in mandating the shot. And while some legislators Legislators in Wisconsin have tried to make mandates illegal. Those efforts have failed, meaning only rare medical and religious exemptions can prevent a worker at Epic from getting vaccinated. But the guidance is clear from CDC and other public health agencies that um, the best thing you can do is get vaccinated to keep your family, employees, people you work with, and people in the community safe. We take that very seriously. This news comes as the Delta variant in Wisconsin surges, with the state surpassing 1,000 new cases in one day, this week for the first time since April. Epic says it considers itself a leader by making this decision. A big part of our role in healthcare is to, to set the standard and, and be a leader. Um, we want to be a leader in the healthcare space to, to lean into the fact that the best thing to do is, is get vaccinated and um, make it clear to others that that's the right thing to do. And in just a few weeks, Epic will host its users group meeting at its campus in Verona, bringing in executives and other system users from all over the country. They've announced anyone attending that event will also need to be vaccinated beforehand as well. Adam Duxter, thank you so much for doing that. And uh, obviously this is something that we're gonna be continuing to watch around the country. Absolutely. Thanks so much, Adam, we appreciate it.